Hey, what's up guys? It's your boy Andrew. It's uh, February 26, 2024. It's just a quick uh, little um, speech, I guess. It's regarding uh, people going through a heartbreak. I know um, lately, if you look at my shorts, I've been um, focusing on like mental health awareness and like helping people out. I know I helped out my buddy uh, Alvin regarding heartbreaks and to uh, people out there um, when somebody breaks up with you as obvious as it may seem you just gotta like let them go I know um, you know people let's say with like anxious uh, attachment types or um, whatever else you want to call it uh, tends to want to like fix things and the thing is, is like, when this person, like, uh, breaks up with you, right, they cut ties with you, they have, like, thought about this uh, before, most times people already have, like, broken up with you, um, weeks, months, geez, maybe years prior to it happening, so they've already gone through, like, the grieving process, and to you, when you hear the news, when you get broken up with, it's like, you're like, dang, like, it just happened all of a sudden, you know? But, um, you know, this person, you know, if they don't communicate it to you, maybe, uh, maybe you messed up, you know what I mean? It takes two to tango. And, uh, you didn't pay attention. But at times, a lot of people, um, just, like, break up with you. And then they might not have an explanation depending if you meet these people in apps you know nowadays with technology you're not gonna get that sense of like closure and the thing is is that as cliche as it may sound like you do have to like just leave them alone you know there's instances where like you want to just like fix things and keep contacting them and then some people get like restraining orders or whatever and you don't want to be in that situation um if they chose to have hours, days, weeks, and months not to be with you, I mean, do you really want to be with that person? And the best thing you can do is to work on yourself. I know there's tons of videos out there saying that, like, you got to focus on yourself, you got to work on yourself, and it's true. You know, um, don't contact them. Uh, I know it's going to be hard. It's going to cause a lot of anxiety, a lot of pain and suffering, but it's like, you know, if this person really chose not to be with you, unfortunately, you just have to accept that. You don't want to, like, beg this person to be in your life because it's like, it's it's that's even more sad, you know, it's like, you have to beg them to be in your life. That's That's a bummer. That's a bummer. I know it's like <clears throat> some people, you know, especially that just got freshly uh, broken up with. It's like, no, man, I'd rather, uh, you know, lose my dignity and beg them. Um, I've been there, done that. And it's disrespectful to yourself. Um, you have to uh, increase your value as a person and be strong, whatever being strong means to you. And, uh, improve yourself you know like I've said to uh, some videos you know videos I might not have released uh, the flood is coming and you know there's gonna be more losses that's gonna happen I've said this to you know my friends and people leave comments on my videos that um, there's gonna be death in the family like death of your mother and father if they're still around and a lot of like losses will happen and best thing I could suggest is uh, with the best of your ability I know it's in my opinion it's hard to do your best per se is to uh, obviously focus on fitness move the body you know uh, do your best not to isolate uh, at times you know I've done that myself where I isolate myself because it's like you don't want other people hurting you so you isolate yourself that way 
you won't get hurt anymore. But you do have to um, do what you can to hang out with people, even if you have a few people. If you don't, find a group, join a group, uh, seek for professional help, you know, therapy, whatever uh, style it may be. If you can't afford that, there will be programs, you know, um, in your city, hopefully. Um, you know, ask around for help, depending where you're at, what country you're at. And I know especially for men, it's hard to uh, seek help because we're uh, expected to just like, you know, just not show feelings whatsoever. And, uh, you know, to the men out there, you're not alone, you know. Uh, but yeah, this will be uh, just like a live or a unedited recording. I'm going to release this as part of the uh, Villain Art series. Um, Got to get in an appointment right now. And I hope this helped out, guys. And remember that, like, you matter. You deserve to be here. You deserve really good things in life. And it's your boy Andrew signing out. We'll see you again soon. Peace.